Hey, what is up, Thunderstruck Gaming? I'm Jack, or Union Jack as you can call me, and this is my first video to Thunderstruck Gaming. Shout out to Thunder for letting me upload this to the channel, and yeah, we're going to get straight into the video. So today I'm going to be talking about, you know, what are the best CODs, and is Black Ops 3 the best Call of Duty yet? In my opinion, yeah, it's up there. It's one of the best without a doubt. So in this video, I'm just going to go through, like, what I like about Black Ops 3, what could be fixed, stuff like that. So let's get straight into this commentary. So Black Ops 3 is definitely one of my favourite CODs ever. It's definitely up there with MW3. Modern Warfare 3, that was a good game. Love it. That, that's when that's where I got into Call of Duty. Like, started playing it a lot with my clan. But I'm going to talk about that later. So Black Ops, we're going to start with Black Ops 3. So I think one of the best things in this game are the specialists. It's something new and it's, it's really, really fun. I think every specialist is good. I don't think there's one specialist that is absolutely useless that no one uses. There's a good variety of specialists and a lot of people use them. Personally, my favourite specialist, I, I like combat focus because I like getting my score streaks, uh, purifier, annihilator. Th there's just so many and they are so fun to use. I think specialists make Black Ops 3 so much better. If it weren't for specialists, I don't think this would be my favourite Call of Duty. I really do like specialists. So, one bad thing, score streaks, they suck. They are so... They're just shit, to be honest. Uh, <laughs> they are awful. The, the Hellstorm, what is that? It does nothing. Got the Lightning Strike, that's awful. Everything is bad. Every score streak. Like, the wraps, what's that? Like a 13 kill streak, and it gets like three maps when you call it on the... Three kills when you call it on the map. But, yeah, score streaks are really bad. GI unit, what is that? It's it's such a high score streak, and it's just so bad. It just runs around in circles. They really need to sort out the score streaks. They're nowhere near as good as, you know, MW2. You've got the Apache, you got the AC-130. You've got really awesome score streaks. Well, kill streaks that do a lot of damage, but, yeah, score streaks, they're awful. I mean, you have got a few good score streaks. I mean, you've got the Cerberus, that's okay. Hardened Sentry... You know, you got stuff like that, but the highest score streaks, the one that take ages to get, are that they, they are just the badder ones. They that badder is that worse? They're worse than the lower score streaks. The lower score streaks are pretty good. So you you, you know you've got the you've got the Talon, which is you know kind of midway. We've got the Wraith. They they're good score streaks, but the higher you get, I, they just the worse they get. It's, they need to sort it out. They need to make the higher score streaks a lot better than the lower score streaks. They're also keeping the game going, Treyarch are keeping the game going, they're bringing out new updates, new patches, fixing the game, they're listening to their fans. People are complaining on YouTube, Reddit, whatever, and they're going through, their, they're looking at stuff to fix, and they're fixing it. Uh, yeah, they're fixing a lot of stuff, they're also keeping the game going, so by that I mean they're adding new levels, so if you get to Master Prestige, they've added 1,000 new levels, which is pretty much going to keep you going for the whole year, I mean... I don't think anyone's got past level 600 that I've seen yet, and they added a thousand levels like I don't know what three weeks ago. So it's pretty pretty crazy. They're also they've also gave you dark matter. So if you've got diamond, why not go for dark matter? That is a grind. I'm I'm currently going for it, but I don't think I'll get it for a few years. It's gonna take forever, but they're keeping it going. They're bringing out new stuff, and we've got the DLC in February that's gonna spice things up, get people back on the game. But overall, it's a great game. So. Yeah, Black Ops 3 is an amazing game. I'm going to get into my top 5 Call of Duties. What I want you guys to do is to comment your your favourite COD ever. Just comment it down below. Like, I've got a feeling you guys are going to say Black Ops 2. I know that's a favourite COD for a lot of people. But I'm going to go through my top 5 favourite CODs. Starting at 5. Worst. Well, not worst, but it's pretty low down. And then obviously 1's my favourite COD. So I'm only including 5. I mean, what? how many Call of Duties is there? There's like... 9 or 10, I don't know, there's quite a few, but I'm going to get straight into this. So in 5th spot, I've put NWT, this is where I started playing Call of Duty, I didn't play it that much, I got my uh, PS3 when MW2 was out, and it was a great game, I I don't know about you guys, I used to trick shot on it, that's like how I started playing Call of Duty, I found it really fun, but I also like to uh, use normal guns and just wreck on that, the kill streaks were really, really cool, uh, you can also get a nuke without something brand new, a nuke! can blow up the whole map awesome so yeah I, I like i remember getting my first nuke on derail my heart was pumping like 50 beats per second it was crazy but yeah get my first nuke that was insane that was a really good day so in fourth place i've got ghosts it's above mw2 you guys might not like it i got the hardened edition so i got all the dlcs with it but ghosts was a i i, I don't have any complaints against it 
The connection was fine. Everything was fine. I I've, I know a lot of people hate it. I'm not sure why. I, I think uh, the majority of people hate it because their favorite YouTubers said they it's a shit game. Like, oh my god, he said it's bad. Oh, it must be a shit game. But it's it's a good game. I like Ghosts. There's nothing wrong with it. And it's pretty cool. I don't think it was that bad at all. So in third spot, we've got Black Ops 2. This was a good game. This is, I actually pre-ordered this game off Amazon and got it a day early, which was pretty amazing. There was only like 6,000 people on it, and then the next day when it came out, there was like 500,000 people on it. Sadly, with the newer CODs, for some reason, they don't tell you how many people are playing. I mean, in Black Ops 3, they put the percentage of people, but they don't say how many people are actually playing it. But Black Ops 2 was a good game. Diamond Camel, that was brand new. Gave you a lot of stuff to do. The maps were awesome. Zombies was... A really good experience added a lot of maps wasn't a big fan of transit but the dlcs for zombies were really really good very diarized you know insane zombie maps really good dlc i enjoyed the dlc usually usually i disable the dlc because i hate it i mean I, i'm not buying season pass anymore unless until the first dlc comes out because every time i get season pass i do not like the dlc and in black ops 2 you can't disable it i know in black uh, mw3 you can push select and it will disable the DLC maps when you're matchmaking. But on this game, you can't. So <laughs> you either play the DLC or you can disable it manually through the options on the PS3. So in second place, runner-up, I've got MW3. This, alright, you know what? This is kind of joint place with Black Ops 3. I think Black Ops 3 just edges out in front. But MW3 was amazing. I love this game. Also, the release of like Call of Duty Elite. Uh, you can make your own clans and stuff. I joined a clan on there. They had like weekly competitions. It was really, really fun. Uh, it was really interactive. And they had a mob better than a nuke because it doesn't end the game. I, I didn't like nukes because it ended the game. Like you could get a nuke like, you know, three minutes into the game if you're a pretty decent player. And you, all you need is your AC-130. And also it was a 25 gun streak. No, no kill streaks allowed. So MW3 was my favorite card. I joined the clan. I was playing with my clan every Friday for like three hours straight. An amazing game definitely one of my favorite Call of Duty's but I think my favorite is Black Ops 3. Black Ops 3 is just such a good Call of Duty. Everything about it is good. Obviously they need to make some fixes but it's only been out for like three months. There's still a lot of work that needs to be done but it's an amazing amazing game. I love this game. Black Ops 3 is great. So guys that is it for this video. Shout out to Thunder for letting me upload. Also check out my channel. It should be down in the description below. Check out my videos. That would be awesome. And make sure you comment your favorite Call of Duty down below in the comment section. That is it. Thank you for listening and I'll see you in the next video.